Welcome to THP Tutorials. In this video, we'll take a look at Decision Support Systems, DSS for short. Right, so we'll look at what DSS is and we'll look at a type of DSS, which is Executive Information Systems, EIS for short. Let's begin. Yeah, so DSS, let's get on with it. Right, so these systems support complex non routine decisions, and their primary purpose is to process data into information. Right, now DSS systems are typically employed by tactical level management, whose decisions and what if analysis are less structured. Now, before we continue, you realize that it's said here that. DSS is typically used by tactical level management, but it is also used by, you know, the strategic level, and we'll get with that. We we we'll go on with that now. So basically, non-routine decisions, right? And it, it's used to um, uh, analyze or. One of the rules it, it helps management in is what the their decisions and also what if analysis. Now the these information systems not only present the results but also expand the information with alternatives, right? And some of the ways DSS does it does this is what through methodologies such as mathematical modeling simulations that's a what if queries data mining and forecasting right so it helps management make decisions like the name like the name suggests decision support systems but not only does it do that but it goes an extra mile and that's what we mean by expands the information with alternatives right so it can tell you what will happen if you take this course of action it can tell you that you know, if you go with option A, this is what is likely to happen, right? And that's what we mean by what that's what we mean by the what if analysis. What if we take this course of action? What if we buy this company? What if we go and make this deal? What will happen? What if we increase salary of our employees? Like all these things, right? So the, the methodologies utilized in DSS include what mathematical modeling, simulations, queries, data mining, and forecasting, right? So we we'll look at EIS now. EIS is a special type of decision support system, and it's also designed to support decision making at the top level of an organization. Right. So that's why in the diagram, you know, in the intro, in the <laughs> sorry, that's why in the introduction. We realize that on the triangle, the at the at the top at the strategic level, you have a decision support system over there, and this is why. Now, yeah, so EIS is used for decision making at the what the top level, and as an an EIS may help a CEO to get an accurate picture of overall operations and a summary of what competitors are doing. Now, these systems are generally easy to operate and present information in ways easy to quickly absorb, like graphs, charts, you know, etc. So that's it, right? Now, thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. You know, if you have found this video helpful, that that is so. Please feel free to do that. Thank you very much for watching THP tutorials. Bye.